it is me, it is, in a new wig. Hi guys, Monroe Still here from Fashion Still NYC and welcome back to my channel. Do not forget to like, all the likes matter guys, and subscribe. I am currently challenging myself to get 20,000 subscribers by the end of 2019. If you could help me do that by recommending my channel, sharing it with your family and friends, it would be much appreciate it so i know you've been waiting today is the day i'm going to show you what i got during the black friday sales i hope you guys checked out that blog post because it was amazing anywho and also a few things i got in new from pr companies clothing and accessories we're gonna just jump right in but let me show you my outfit because I know you wanna know. Let me just start with the wig because I know I'm gonna get 100,000 questions about it. This wig is called the Charlie wig and it is from Big Chop Hair. I love Big Chop Hair, black owned business. The owner is amazing. Make sure to follow them on Instagram here. It is the Charlie wig, it is $250 I think. They are running some kind of promotion. You can check it out. It's one of my favorite wigs. This makeup look, oh my God. I've been really into orange. This is the Sephora I Love palette in the jewel tone. The lipstick is NARS Endangered Red. It is my favorite kind of red, brown, brick color red for winter i wear it all the time in the winter season and i love it i'll put a link down below let me show you my outfit you guys i don't know what it is i used to hate the color pink which is crazy because i'm an aka i think i told you guys this a few times but now i love pink dare i say it's my favorite color <laughs> you guys <laughs> i know all my sorority is gonna be so proud of me <laughs> Pink is where it's at. I know that they just announced that the color of the year or next year is like classic blue, but nah, we're not here for it. We're here for pink. This dress was a PR gift from And Other Stories. I absolutely love these baby doll dresses. This is actually a size eight. I am usually a size six, but I have broad shoulders and I wanted it to be a certain length on me. I'm five six. And so I got the eight and it fits really well. I love it. I paired it with my Tamara Melon Icon boots. Super comfy. And that is my look for today. So let's just get straight into everything new in that I got and a few buys that I got for Black Friday. Ah! First up, I'm going to show you a few pair of earrings that I bought from Shopbop during their Buy More, Save More sale. Then they had an extra 10% off sale. Both of the sets of earrings that I got are by Diana Broussard. I hope I'm saying that correctly. The first set are these. They're like mirrored geometrical earrings. I mean, I know they look heavy, but they're actually super duper light. But I love the backs of their earrings, how they are made. They have this little clip that then like clips up against the part that comes out so that you don't need an earring back. I absolutely love that about the earrings. This is the first set that I got. I think they still have these on Shopbop and a few other websites. They come in a few different colors, but I love like the silver and gold. I just thought it would be such a great holiday earring. In addition to that, I got another set of earrings by the same designer, Diana Broussard. These are just so cool. Like, look at that shape. It is so weird. I absolutely love it. And then the base there is kind of like, they do a lot with like glass and plastic and reflective pieces. So I love these. I think these might actually be sold out on Shopbop, but if I can find them anywhere else, I will put them down in the description box. What I love about these earrings is that you know, when I'm wearing my hair natural, I usually wear it slipped back in a little ponytail. And so I need something, dangling something, something to, you know, make it a little more feminine since I pretty, pretty much look like I'm bald. But I love that look. I think it's so chic. Just a really nice statement earring. I find just zhuzhes up the look immensely. So let me show you what else I got in from and other stories. In addition to them sending me this dress, 
They also sent me a pair of earrings. Actually, I picked out the dress and the earrings. Like I said, I've really been into statement earrings and I just love these. Like how cool are these? So this one has like a little pink ball there and this one has a little yellow ball. And I feel like they just remind me so much of Jack Moose. I just like them. How cool. And like I said, I'm really into pink now. So having more accessories, like earrings that incorporate pink, just really works for me. Super cute. They definitely still have these at End of the Stories. So I will put a link down to them below. I think that's it as far as accessories. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you probably my favorite item that I got during the Black Friday sales. Of course it's shoes. Shoes, you know it's shoes. You know, and I know that it's shoes. Ah! You guys, this is my first pair of Manolo Blahnik. I've been on the lookout for a pair of their the yellow satin pumps with you know the little rectangle of like diamonds or whatever on it. I found a pair in my size in Paris, and I had planned to get those while in Paris, but I actually just didn't have time to actually make it to the store. In fact, I had time to do really nothing that I would have liked to do myself. Our schedule while we were in Paris was just jam packed and I absolutely love everything that we got to do, but there was no downtime to do anything else. I recently went to the new Nordstrom here in New York City, y'all. I finally got the chance to go, not during the grand opening that I showed you in a vlog, but just to go and check out all of the goods. And they were having some really amazing sales for the holidays. And I was able to get these. I know you're just like, girl, if you don't go ahead and open the box. By the way, if you are subscribed to my newsletter, you already know what's in this box because, you know, people who are on my newsletter subscription list, they always get the goods first so if you are not subscribed i'll put a link to subscribe below literally all you have to do is put in your email and that's it okay so y'all know how i said i've been loving pink well ah, they were too good to miss oh my goodness so there are the bb lilium pink suede manolo pumps and they are just divine you guys like look at them I mean like wow these are definitely my favorite shoes at the moment I've already worn them <laughs> a few times I think they're just so chic and classic I found that this style of Manolo actually runs a little bit big I'm usually a 41 and any shoe made in Italy but I actually had to size down to a 40 and a half because my foot was just swimming in the 41 so if you're interested in the Manolo BB perhaps size down a half a size but the quality of these the color the vibrancy i could not pass them up and plus one of my fashion heroes tracy ellis ross has the same shoes and i got them for a pretty good deal i think i got them for 350 dollars which was 50 percent off yeah y'all i'm so happy about these you're gonna see them all winter as long as it doesn't snow I'm wearing them. I'm also taking them with me to Miami, so get ready for the content. I'll put a few links down below. They come in a ton of colors. I think at the Nordstrom's here, in the in-store, they have pink, they have yellow, and I think they have green. I might actually go back for the yellow ones. I'm not sure yet. I'm trying to wait and see if they go on sale a little bit more, but if you're interested, I'll put a few down below in the description box. But remember what I said about the sizing. Of course, it came with a little dust bag as well my favorite purchase i feel so very carrie bradshaw-ish you guys so i bought one dress from ukes ukes is also owned by i think net porter it's a really great website for finding designer deals on sale they might be a few seasons old but like it's totally worth it so i was perusing the site during the black friday sales and i found this diane von Furstenberg dress it is a maxi dress. It has like this kind of ruching on it. I just thought that it was super cool. It's kind of a mesh deal going on here. And I got the small. So for size, I am a size six. I usually wear a medium, but in DVF things, 
I always go for the small because their sizing tends to run big. And I only know because sometimes the PR from DVF sends me things and I always used to request a medium and then it would just be too big. And the small fit perfectly. The small fits like a dream. I love this pattern and the colors. I think it's super fun fun for fall and for winter. I had a vision in my head of what I was gonna wear with this and it just turned out perfectly. I actually included this dress in my newsletter to let people know what I was buying ahead of time. So like I said, if you're not subscribed and you want the deets first, you should subscribe, you know? Love this dress. I actually already shot it, so you'll see it soon over on the blog and on the gram. I think they have a few more left. If they do, I will put a link down below. And like I said, I got the small. <sighs> Next up guys, this is probably my second favorite purchase only because I specifically waited until it went on sale at and other stories for their Black Friday sale to buy it. I did, I waited. Even though I know the PR people, you know, I have a limit. This is the hourglass blazer trench coat and what i love about it is this i love that hourglass shape that it goes in and then comes out and jets down it's just super chic it's really kind of thick the fabric is so luxe this is definitely balenciaga inspired i don't feel like it goes out as far as the balenciaga jacket but i actually prefer that it doesn't it's very subtle it has two little buttons here and it's just really, really a very well-made coat. Originally, it was $250, and then it was, I think, 25% off. I can't remember exactly how much I paid for it, but I think it was $200. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it's still on sale, but even if it wasn't, it's a great buy. I'm gonna wear it all winter long with my maxi dresses and my satin skirts with my thigh-high boots, just, can you see all of the content, all of the amazing winter outfits that I'm gonna create with this coat? Because I have broad shoulders, but I'm pretty much a size medium, I usually go for the six in clothing from and other stories, but in tops and jackets, I always get a bigger size to accommodate my broad shoulders. So in this jacket, I got an eight, US eight and it fits perfectly. So, I mean, if you can, I would go to the store and try it on just to make sure. But if not, I would size up one size if you want it to fit not so snug that you can't wear a thick sweater. Oh, this is a rich auntie coat for sure. And other stores is where it's at. I, have, I, I just love them. So I also bought a few things that I haven't actually got in yet. I mean, it happens. This is what happens during the holiday season, you think even though you put express shipping that it's gonna be express, but it's not because it's the holidays and there are too many sales and like people are backed up and the UPS men are just overwhelmed and so are, are the United States Postal Service men and you know, I get it, I do. So I'm gonna be patient, but I still wanna show you guys what I got. So I actually bought a bra, not just any bra. I have been coveting this bra ever since I saw it on Instagram. It is from Chua. Trois, un, deux, trois, trois, three, the label. Really cool brand, all of the cool girls wear them. I wanted this bra so bad, you guys, but I just didn't want to pay full price for it. Luckily, it was on sale and I snagged it. I got it in white. I wanted it in black, but the black was sold out. I hope it comes back soon and I'm probably gonna buy that one too. But I mean, I really love the white one as well because what I will do is when I'm down in Miami, I can like pair it underneath my Frankie Shop blazer and just throw on some little Bermuda shorts and a heel. Ugh, y'all gonna get some Miami content. Can you see it though with a blazer over top or even like something sheer? I mean, it's just a really cute bra to show off, you know? So you guys, I am now a Revolve ambassador. Yes, you heard right, Revolve. Yes, 
that revolve. I was actually really surprised that they reached out to me to work with them. And so they're going to be sending me pieces every month and I'm gonna be picking the best pieces to show you guys, of course, and styling them for you in blog posts and on Instagram. So, I mean, it's a step. I'm actually really excited about it. So let me show you the last order that I just got in from Revolve. A few of these things, I'm gonna take to Miami, so you'll see them then. First up is this really nice balloon sleeve sweater. It is super cozy, guys. I just love it. It's perfect for winter. You could pair it with like faux leather pants and an oversized blazer or even my and other stories. Trench coat would look good. The brand is L'Academy. I got a size medium. And like I said, the balloon sleeves are just so in right now. Definitely gonna be wearing this all winter in a nice neutral color. I'm not sure, I think it does come in some other colors. I'll put a link down to it below in the description box. And I got the medium. Next up, I got this super cute dress by Super Down. If you've never heard of this brand and you wear a lot of like going out dresses, party dresses, dresses for like Miami or for carnivals, the brand is perfect. It, it speaks to that whole kind of chill, party, hot weather vibe. I actually love a lot of their dresses from the site. I have like a folder full of favorites. I got this one. It has very thin straps. It has a rose print on it. It's a mini dress. It's also mesh and it looks like it's a screen printed or some kind of printed print on there but Super cute, I got the size medium and it fits like a dream. Definitely gonna rock this down in Miami, so stay tuned. Next up, I got this super cute top from NBD. Got the size medium. It is a brown, it's really hard to hold up, sweater, but it has one long sleeve and then on the other end there is no sleeve and then it's kind of a off the shoulder moment i actually love this color i i don't have many brown things in my wardrobe and so i thought it would be a good idea to get a nice neutral brown sweater i love this i can tuck it into my satin skirts to a pair of denim jeans and it'll look amazing next up is another type of sweater dress and i think this is my favorite thing that i got from this order it's also l'academy and I got the size small. I actually read the reviews, so I usually order a medium and things, but for some reason I think this runs big, so if you're interested in it, definitely size down. I got the small, but I almost feel like I couldn't even get an extra small because I still have a little space, but it is an off the shoulder or one shoulder sweater dress with the high slit. It's a midi dress. It looks so amazing on it and I love the color. It is ribbed. It's a nice cool gray. And what I think I'm gonna do is pair this with my gray tomorrow melon boots and my gray Celine bag and just have a whole gray moment. I feel like gray is one of my favorite colors next to pink. It's super comfy too. It's a really great material, very well made. And last, <laughs> but certainly not least, it's a little wild, but I got this dress with this huge pink bow that's very long. So it's kind of a, a sweetheart neckline. It has kind of a built-in bustier and it has this ruched fabric. I mean, it's very kind of 80s and I absolutely love it. I love the color, you guys know I'm into pink. It also has this little rubber piece to kind of hold up so you don't need to wear a bra. This is also NBD and I got the size medium. The medium fits perfectly. This is definitely a mini dress. I'm 5'6 if you're interested. I got this dress because I'm actually heading to a party and the theme of the party is Studio 54. <laughs> and <laughs> the dress code was come fabulous and I was like if this doesn't scream studio 54 I don't know it does okay so you guys are definitely gonna see this on my feed soon 
I might even save it and drop it on New Year's, but I will be vlogging <laughs> that event. I'm actually over the moon about it. <laughs> Rose is gonna come with me, so watch out for that vlog soon. I think it's actually gonna go live on Wednesday. All right, and that is all that I got from Revolve, but since they're going to be sending me things monthly, I'll be showing you every month what I got from them. And I'm just really excited to be working with them and hopefully, you know, representing more girls that look like me. All right, guys, so that is it for everything I bought from the Black Friday sales and a few things I got in from PR. Everything can be found below in the description box. And thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like if you haven't yet. I mean, if you're still watching at this point, you might as well just like it. I mean, it helps me and it, and it helps me to help you. Help me help you this holiday season. And subscribe if you haven't yet. Stay tuned, I got some vlogs coming for you guys, like Day in the Life New York City vlogs and travel vlogs because I'm going home to North Carolina for the holidays and I am also heading to Miami for the New Year's. So lots of fun new things coming up soon. You won't wanna miss it. Make sure you're subscribed. All right guys, let me know what your favorite purchase or thing that I got in from PR was. Mine's the Manolos and the end of the story shirt for sure. All right, later.